what it looks like to bounce a steel ball on one of the world's bounciest surfaces. Cool. <laughs> this system has a coefficient of restitution of over 97%. That's speed after collision divided by speed before collision. Literally measures how bouncy something is. Whoa. <laughs> this illustrates an important principle in how you slow down neutrons in a nuclear reactor. With something like water or graphite, these neutrons bounce a lot, slowing them down, have better odds of hitting a uranium-235 and causing a fission. Similar principle. It seems like it should stop bouncing now, but watch how it just continues to bounce up and down at a faster and faster vibration. Because it's closer. Even That's though it looks like it's not bouncing anymore, you can still see it just vibrating back and forth. Here's a regular ping pong ball. <laughs> Basically your neutron and your graphite. Kinda. Now surprisingly, you can make this surface by yourself at home. It's just a balloon stretched over a cup. Technically, you could even make the neutron moderator at home just by opening up a faucet.